So what's going on? We back with another one. We got this uh reaction. We got Coach uh, Warren Sapp. You know, he uh, just got hired on as uh, Colorado uh, as a defensive analyst working with the D-line. So, hey, man, I feel like Colorado making some moves. So, let's see what they D-line looking like. They definitely got to get home this year, get on some sacks, get some more QB pressures. And I feel like with his energy and what he brings, you know, he a Super Bowl winner, Hall of Famer. So, let's see if that uh, going to play some effect on this season. But let's see what they got going on. Let me see. DN. There you go, right there. Okay. 41 hard. He played that linebacker. I like 42. He played a little bit last year, but I feel like he's going to blow up this year. Now I want to look straight. He burnt. Buddy just like Aaron Donald. He only about six foot. Five and them. Came from Houston. And you see how Warren Sapp on they on they uh on their head. Buddy moving slow motion. Oh, they threw him out the club. There you go. There you go. Good job. Yeah, they can't throw him out the club. They can't throw him out the club. Get Warren out. Ooh, get split. Shout out O-Lyman got going on, man. How y'all let that man split y'all like that, man? That's a Hall of Famer right there. Go jacket teaching you boys up. And I feel like he know how to translate the game for the boys. They almost threw him out the club. He still made it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Get him right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Okay. And them trenches be getting down. I ain't even care. I wish I was tall. I wish I was probably like 6'5 when I was playing. I also play stand up DN. Come out that edge. Speedy Gonzalez. Good route. Team gonna go out this year. One, three. Hmm. Good route. Good route. Good hands. If he just had some more distance on it, he'd be good. The kicker, the first kicker. Three need to put on a little bit more weight. He'd be good to go. Cole Prime got the workout fit on. He got the construction fit on. So I'm going to work. I hope number four ball out too though. He came from Florida State. He had an ACL last year. So I feel like he's going to turn up. They definitely need him. Make the tackle, make the tackle. That boy got the baguettes on. This the DC that came from uh, Cincinnati.
Ooh! Hit him with that bat juke. Oh, good D. That boy Shallow got the one. Oh, that's a ball. Let's see. Ooh, good throw. Good throw. I ain't gonna lie, since Colorado moving to the Big 12, too, I'll probably I'll give him about seven, eight wins this season. Seven, eight wins. Probably like three, four losses. Just depending. Cause last year they lost all their games less than eight points. So second year round, they getting used to all these cameras out and always in their face and stuff. So that ain't too much like threw off by the cameras and stuff. So I feel like they gonna be straight. And remember these folks. Colorado, Coach Prime doing something that ain't never been done in football before, but uh, regarding to this uh, media stuff, in these videos, they just, we ain't never seen nothing like this. Ooh, tackle. Sad. Humble. It's hard. The first is kind of like, hey, like Coach Palm, and I think like you just in all games. I think you like really get used to him. like when you're really here, you just try and soak in like as much knowledge from him as he has off. Not only from a player, but just as a person. It's hilarious every day. It's, it's real. It's a lot of hard work, but it's a lot of. But he plays safety too. I feel like he's hard. You got to give him a shot. You get top in the right way, but like that's what it's like. John Cena. Von Miller. He hard too. He plays safety. He give me them Tyree and Matthew vibes. Walker was hard too. He was what, 52 or 55? That boy got two smoothies. They got big jacuzzis. Jimmy Horn, my boy, you got to go crazy this year. Yeah, man, but that's it. We got this uh, reaction wrapped up. Let me know what y'all think, how y'all feel about Warren Sapp being a, a defensive analyst. Is y do y'all think he gonna like have a big effect or you think it ain't gonna be too much? Cause he ain't, he ain't the D-line coach, he's just an analyst. So, but at the same time, his energy, I feel like even just seeing what we saw right there, I feel like he bringing like a certain type of swag, certain type of energy where he like, he was like aggressive type of D-line when he played, he was like a, he had attitude, he gonna talk trash, he gonna play nasty. So it's like, Coach Prime already liked that. Now you done brought another player who Hall of Fame, won the Super Bowl, first round, All-American in college. He done walked in this and I feel like I could see that fire burning in him. 
So I feel like that's definitely going to help their D-line. In my opinion, I feel like that's going to help the D-line play with some swag. And somebody going to step up this season. So, yeah, we're going to keep – we're going to uh, stay locked in on Colorado. I ain't going to lie. I'm the same. I'm a, hey, hey, I'm riding too. I'm on the uh, Coach Prime train too. So we're going to see what's going on. But, yeah, drop a like. Subscribe. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. And uh, mo on the way. See we out. Let's go.